Hi, I'm Kate. So, Rebecca told you that all animals need food and water, but they need two more things, shelter and space. And I'm here to talk about shelter and space. Now, I want you to think about the word shelter. When you hear the word shelter, what do you think about? What does your shelter look like? So now you may have an idea of what shelter looks like for humans, but what do you think shelter looks like for animals? We're gonna look at four different shelters that animals in Colorado might have. Can you guess which shelter belongs to the beaver? I'll give you a clue. Beavers live near water and they build their shelters out of sticks. Now, what shelter do you think would be used by an ant? I'll give you a clue. Ants build their shelter in the ground and they pile dirt and tunnel in it. Now, what about a bird? Here's your clue. Birds often build their nests in trees and they use sticks or grass or things they can find and carry with their beaks. Our last one is a bear. Bears will sometimes dig under fallen stumps or rocks and they need a lot of space. Can you guess which one is the bear shelter? So we've seen that shelters are different depending on the animal. Shelters are different because animals have different needs. An ant definitely doesn't need as much space as a bear. And birds, they might like their shelter high up in trees, while beavers want their shelter near the water. We're gonna now build our own shelter. I'm gonna build a house for a mouse. This is my mouse house. If you're really quiet, you might be able to hear the water. There's a river across the street. I made my house near the river because all animals need water. And I think these are gonna be good mouse food. Now, my mouse house is good shelter. It means that it's protected. So I have a nice little roof to keep out the snow, and I put lots of soft things like pine needles in there to insulate it or to keep my mouse warm. Now my mouse house is going to be far away from other mouse houses because all animals need space. Why do you think animals need space? Hmm. Could you imagine if you had to share a bedroom with all your brothers, all your sisters, all your cousins, your aunts, your uncles, your grandma, your great grandma? Yeah, that would kind of stink, right? We need space to be able to move around. And animals need that too. An animal's space is called its territory. And if an animal's territory gets too small and other animals get near its territory, it might not be able to get enough food or enough water or any of the other things it needs. That's why animals need a certain amount of space. So now you've learned about the four needs that all animals have for their habitats. Now you can go exploring. Try and figure out how people like you, humans, can meet their four needs. Or you can come up with an animal that lives in Colorado and try and build a shelter for that animal and incorporate all four of that animal's needs. Have fun.